I actually never yapped about my legal case that I was dealing with a couple months ago with my sexual harasser landlord. I just kind of made an edit about it and just moved on with my life. But basically, this is what happened. My friend who was living with me in this van, we had our own issues. I was projecting all my problems onto her. My landlord took advantage of her and me living in his guest house by trying to sexually coerce her, someone who not only did not consent, but was unwilling to be with, near, around him. She didn't even want to talk to him. It was a relationship where she just wanted to pay rent and be left alone. He didn't tolerate that. And so he started to be aggressive and retaliatory. And he started to harass us and basically stalk us. Uh, he would wake us up in the middle of the night and just be a weirdo. Once I started to get angry and aggravated... And I started to record it and I started to plan my moving out. He then went to the court and said that I was threatening him and his son with a gun. Mind you, over the eight month period that I lived with him, I had babysat his son over seven, eight times. And it's just crazy to me because I lost my gun rights in this case. I can't have a gun. And so if you see me in my van, I'm a walking lick unless you want to get stabbed. <laughs> I don't need guns to defend myself. The last burglar that tried to break into this van literally got his ass beat. The next one's getting stabbed. <laughs> this is just how it is.